so. Make sure this is all flying off on me here again, like it did last time. going on guys I'm just gonna fix this up here <laughs> trying out the new duel hey how you doing these backyard woodworking how you doing buddy just doing a live video also uh, trying out the new box that I just got it's got a just built it not very pretty but hell I ain't worried about pretty and I'm just gonna screw in <clears throat> this is the new tool I just wanted it's a Dremel Dremel Go it's called so it's like a little screwdriver right so we're gonna give it a go. I can just find the damn holes in here. Ooh, that works good. <laughs> yeah, it's different. Get on the site. It doesn't cost anything. And all you have to do is, you know, when they, they, they'll send you updates and um, uh, they'll tell you when there's, you know, stuff to make and you could win and you trying to share that with all your friends and get them to vote for you kind of thing? I guess. I don't know. Oh, look at Mr. Mike. Mike, I won. Something. It's a screwdriver. So I'm just putting together... Just putting together my... Um, er, my, whoop, my box. Don't do that twice. Uh, I'm on there just never entered anything oh well yeah you gotta you gotta get your name in there buddy no big deal I mean it's nice that they give away some stuff <coughs> so that's it I just this is what I did I just built a box <coughs> I put a fan in it I built a box in the back got to start painting this guy up that's I got to get that guy done so uh, I'll just slowly look at the comments at the same time that I'm doing this um, if I miss what you're saying oops if I miss what you're saying just say hey you didn't answer my question or just watch what I'm doing I don't care that's all good so uh, I think what I'm gonna work on right now is uh, is that a, yeah it's a bathroom fan I put in there it's pretty quiet here I'll I don't know if you can hear it I'll put it on so that should be it's quiet enough for me and then if you see you know what it worked I think the filter's too thick I think that's the problem is the filter is too thick for it so but the suction was there but that's not the test the test is going to be blowing the air in so we're going to turn turn that on 
We're gonna do a little bit of the fish. Fish, fish, fish. Gotta get her. Why is that stuck back there? That's okay. So we're gonna add, this is my own green that I made. This will be the first test. thing to do is yeah thanks Mike Mark uh, what I'm thinking of doing is this might be my outside one and I might just invest in a real good one you know I'm not I'm not sure we'll see how good I am on airbrushing first So far, it's all going in there. So I'm liking that. I think the only thing that I'm having issues with is it'll be the lighting. I need more lighting. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. All right. <laughs> Where's the Mark, don't text me on on there. It's it's coming, man. You're not the only one who orders shit. And I'll tell you a little story. Today I wasn't going anywhere. They put eight fucking needles in my back. Eight needles. So four on each side. And then they had to go half an inch deeper. So... Don't bug me today! But I'm working on your shit, man. you gotta say. Come on, say something. Let's let's talk. This is my own green. I made my own I, I mixed my own green up to give it a different look. What do you think of the color, guys, for, for my fish? Does it look like a green color, too dark, too light? Give me, give me your opinion.
Oh, I don't know. These are. This is a. Uh, the injections I'm getting is. Um, it, it's like a freezing injection you get for your tooth. It numbs it and it goes into your back. I don't know. They just. They stuck a bunch in there. Didn't feel that great. It needs to be more brown for pike. Okay, so you're talking brown. So keeping the green, you're telling me, looks good. Maybe highlight it with some light bluish. Right. Good ideas, guys. Good ideas. Epidural? Um, I think it was an epidural. It was just a. Uh, it was a freezing agent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I know what you're talking about, but no. more like a Nova King. I think that's what it is. Not here. So let me answer that. Started off with the green. Now we're just going to change into some blue. Oh, we're gonna dump this out. Got my pretty schmuck on here. So don't spill it all over me. How's everybody doing today? Somewhat good. Somewhat good. A lot of snow here. It's snowing and it's not snowing and Good. 
did you do with that cardinal bass you carved that fish is awesome too my um uh, in michigan i don't that was my brother my brother bought that off me for his best friend that mark that fish that uh, i carved soon enough uh we're hoping well i'm hoping uh, my buddy charles is uh setting up a, a website and then i'll start displaying some of my stuff on there i'll be displaying some of my stuff on there through my website so people can look at it and buy it kind of thing so i'll have more out there i'm gonna take some blue 35 degrees damn wish I'm stuck somewhere here. Why am I stuck? Because I went wrap that around there, didn't I? Damn it. All right. Lots of cord. It's been carving dogs in Iraq. Charles, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's been doing a couple of things. Helping me with right on, can't wait to see that. So, I don't know if you can see that very well, but I did add some blue to it. Um, I think I'm gonna add some red. I don't know what kind of fish this is, I don't care as long as I got some color. Yeah, good to see everybody on here. There's only like, you know, there's a couple people. That's good enough for me. I don't care. I just want like people saying hi. Hey, Jordy. Jordy Fusion. How you doing, buddy? Just doing a little work on my, with the airbrush uh, paint booth. Trying to get that out. Thanks, man. Uh, I'm thinking it works. I'm not 100% sure. 
it's it's doing what it's supposed to do. That's right, all the important people here, that's right. I'm glad you guys are on there and you support the channel. I'm really glad you guys do that. It makes me happy. Only here for a minute, but it's not popping. Good stuff, George. I'm glad you said hello. That's you guys are all more than welcome to come in and say hi and do whatever and chat a bit. We're just trying to get some, some little bit of color on this fish. Pumpkin Rob, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Pumpkin Rob. How's that update on that, that, uh, that eagle going on there, uh, Jordy? Now, I don't know if you can see that very well with the lighting. I'm going to add some red to it. I'm getting some good suction out of this. Sore as hell, yeah. That's a bitch when you're doing that kind of stuff. I bet you. I bet you they're sore as hell. That chainsaw takes a beating out of you. We're not getting any younger, buddy. Lighting's better, yeah. Good. Uh, I can actually see some stuff. That that helps. Up, uh, I was up pretty early the, the other day, I think it was Sunday, when Mr. Hall was doing the uh, the giveaway on you guys' uh, collaboration. He was up pretty early, that guy. Well, he said 7 o'clock, but for here... It was six. <laughs> All right. That's good. That went well. All right. So now I'm going to add a little bit of red. Does. Yeah, too early. I know. I was just up. I was just up, no matter what. Had fun today. Went and got myself eight needles in my back. See if that that wasn't fun, but I had to get done. That does red. All right, later.
<laughs> Denver, yeah. Get the crap out of me, guys. some red to the underbelly. We'll see how long this lasts. It's not that it's painful, it's just, uh, right now it's just, everything's annoying. man it's like lots of lots of playing around that's for sure Thanks guys, thanks well. Appreciate that. But I gave him I gave him a little bit of a red eye. Mine's upstairs.
things written down. Then I lost it. Shoot. Bear with me, guys, if you're still there. Nice. I bet you it's turning out really good. I had... Damn. Gotta try to remember the colors that I was supposed to put on here. Damn. And I forgot it already. Alright. That's okay though. It could be the last the last thing I'm doing. I was supposed to put inside the, the triangle. I had a piece of paper here and I lost it. Yeah, it does. Oh, it definitely does. It does. So what I'm going to be doing here is I'm just doing a small short video on this. This won't be an all-nighter or a couple hours. Because I got... get my butt relaxed too. I just wanted to show you the fan. Show you what I what I did. It works. It works. It definitely works. It's good to have it close to everything so if there's any fumes like you can see the fumes. I can see the fumes coming out of here. And that's definitely getting sucked right into there right now. Mind you, I don't use... I'm just using acrylics right now. So it's no big deal. This little pot makes a big difference too, guys. Yeah, that'll work too. The little stove ventilation. You get those fans, they got the big filters in it. That'll work. Rob, I think it's just you and me. I don't see anybody else on here. That's right. That's right. Free is for me. You know what? This fan cost me $27 Canadian. And the filters cost me $18. The wood is free. Uh, so... I'm not... I'm not going to complain about that. For what it's worth and what it's working for, I like it. I think it's good. You 
know what? You could spin. I was watching it. Oh. Hey, right, Kelly. All right. Well, thanks for letting me know. Cause you know, what? on my thing, it only says one person. So I don't know who's all here. If anybody's watching or what. I'm glad you you're on. I'm glad you said something. Okay. One of the things I like to do, especially after using a dark color, I always say this before, is to check the needle. All I do is I put water or my solution on here and again just run it through. Yeah, I got it all cold. There's no air flowing out of there. I could feel the air, like I have a box back here. I think in the other video you could see it. There's a box back there and I can feel the air pushing out and it's hitting the filter. I'm gonna find out if it's wet at the end sure if it's taken any they are they do such nice jobs eh? I just I like it I, I like the airbrush better than painting I'm not I'm not comfortable with getting these little paint brushes and getting in there I just can't do that so we're going to go back to the white because our eagle head is supposed to be white. The black was just for highlights. We're going to add some white. So I'll just kind of show you where I'm at, you guys. Uh, bluish red fish, eagle head with an eye, red eye. So I'm just going to get in here. I can get you to do that, buddy. Thanks, Kelly. I know nothing about airbrushing, honestly. I'm not going to tell you no lies. All I know is what I watch and how they do things. I do like to learn. In the 80s, yeah. Uh, pressure wise, I'm not. Just like, because it is spitting out a lot of paint. But it's this, this is that control, right? If you can get that controlled, you won't spit as much out.
<laughs> I'm a little fart. <laughs> You're only as old as you want to be. I know. I have no problems talking to my own bones. Never mind telling somebody else's problems. I hurt all the time. Stupid. So I'm just building up the colors so you could see that there's uh, there's some it's it's still not white okay Yeah, I private too. It's you know, primer could be anything. You don't have to use a primer. You could just use a white a white coat of paint, and that will allow the other paints to adhere better. I don't know. That's the way I've learned. Yeah, paint it white and then I'll put some black and I'll go back to white so that you still see uh, the black inside where I carved. Does that make sense?
bit of splattering happen, guys. I'm just going to work on the feather line. Yeah, it's working good. I'm not getting any fumes anywhere. I'm liking it. It's 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 doing good. I think so.
Right, so I blended some white on its back, on his back. You can see I did the feather tails. Hello, Mike. I don't know if you said hi. into the, the color. <laughs> you need some of that luck, eh? All right, well, I'll try my best to send it to you. Can't promise anything. I never win shit either, tell you guys the truth. This is a, that's the first time I've ever done anything. sit there and you go, I put myself in draws all the time for stuff and I get shit. But again, the Dremel, the Dremel thing is uh, fresh guys, it's new, people are participating in it and they're not and they're, you just gotta be out there, just like anything else, right? Just like YouTube and all that stuff, don't put yourself out there. You'll never get anywhere with it. Thanks, man. Thanks, Mike. I really appreciate that. You know damn well I appreciate that. I'm trying my hardest to get out there. I'm trying to get my hardest to make things right and paint things up and yeah. hoping the dragon that I did was going to leave, but um, fortunately the guy is on holidays and he's been gone for two weeks. So hopefully he comes back and he says he wants it, but if he doesn't, a dabbler, no, 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 you're a carver. Everybody's, everybody's does something once, twice they carve. I don't believe that, man. 
everybody who has some, you know, once you pick up a knife or a, or a, you know, a Dremel or whatever you want to call it, you're starting to create. That's all it takes. It doesn't take much to create. Win. Yeah, win. I've heard of that. Is that is that win? Um, I guess that's that's just a rotary tool, right? Like you know, and it works just as good. Like you don't have to go spend. I don't know. You don't have to go spend big money on stuff. And as long as you're not, you know, busting it, you know. It's. I mean by. What I mean by busting it is, you know, you don't go crazy nuts on it. Right on. Yeah, like a dribble, yeah. What are you doing? You might, you're, I'm packing up eight bowls for a customer today. I've been feeling good and have a, a rare beer. Oh boy. Might you turn same shit, flex shit, right? Okay. Mike, you you turn bowls? Is that what you're saying to me? Um, sometimes I don't get to see most of these guys as art, so I don't know what's going on. Really, I'm not 100 percent sure. I wish I could see more of your stuff. If you guys send me your stuff, I want to see it. You got my email. If you want, I can show it off here, whatever. I have no problem with that. You just gotta give me permission. You gotta send me it. If you need my email, just let me know. I love to see all that stuff, man. All of it, you know that. Okay. It's face, so gotta do that and then I got the, the head gone white I'm gonna add some yellow to the beak and then work on his eyes the back the back we got the feathers going on you know just going on what's uh, Kelly's uh, mainly auto restoration okay you do that out of your house or out of a out of a sh like out of your own shop around your place Thanks, man. You know what? This is actually going to a native, an Indian, a native elder. And uh, I want it to really look good, guys. I had a shop a few years ago. Okay. Yeah. I would love to have something. I, I've been working at the same place for 30 years. Uh, I've been working at, at a hospital. I'm not a doctor or anything like that. I'm not a gynecologist. Could be, though. Um, I'm just a worker. And I'm so tired of it. I need to get my, my butt in gear. What I'd like to do is... Now my nephew has it. I work out of an extra bedroom cover. That's good. I mean, it's, you gotta do what you gotta do to keep busy. You know? If it makes you extra cash, you do it. Yeah, Charles is, uh, yeah, into the automotive. The 
One thing I know about automotive is uh, I need gas once in a while. I can't change a freaking tire or nothing. Well, I shouldn't say I can't. I just... I just don't. Okay, so... I got a little problem here, guys. I gotta... My brush is all tangled up. My cord, my cord. The cord is all tangled up. <laughs> A bid. VWs, all right. Oh, it's right in. Sorry, guys, I went and... There we go, now I got cord. Okay. So, I'm just gonna put that down. Make sure I didn't do anything here I wasn't supposed to do. Okay, give me a second. Okay. It's on Facebook. Okay, you guys are gonna have to give me five minutes. I gotta run to my shop, which is my garage. <laughs> I gotta grab something. I hope you don't mind. If you guys leave, that's fine too. If not, I'll be back. Um, don't ask me anything because I won't be here. Okay. <clears throat> Sliding in front of the lamp. Right? Are you moving? Yeah, 
How are we doing here, guys? Another car going around. Right on. Okay, so I wanted to get some <coughs> yellow on the beak. Put my fan back in. Sorry about that guys, I had to go grab something. some ah it's working really good it's it's taking a lot of a lot of the air out I think I might have to take this piece off here um, I think that's not helping it's it's still sucking in but I think it needs uh, it needs something maybe the maybe the fans not close enough I don't know I'll, I'll work on it Yeah, one day I will, I'll get back. It's so damn cold out there, guys. Like, ugh. You know, I'll tell you what. I love Canada. Don't get me wrong. I love my, I love my country. I love my country more than anything, you know. But, God darn it, it is cold. Like, you go outside, and it's not even nice out there to do anything. You know, different parts of Canada, right, guys? Yeah, no, it's not pulling through the filter as good as I want it to go. <clears throat> different parts of Canada. Um, like, I don't, I know, I know some people in, you know, okay, we'll give you an example. Jordy is in BC, and it's beautiful out there, but the cost of living's high. But it's always nice out there. Here in Winnipeg, Manitoba, cost of living is one of the lowest, and it's and I'm, I'm born and raised here. But we get snow, right? We get a lot of snow. Uh, Ontario, it's a hit and miss. You know, Quebec, hit and miss.
I know I'm cold. I know how to keep my lawn johns on. And when not to go outside and when to go outside. I'm in... Now it's NC, North Carolina. I, yeah, sorry guys. I, I'm not too familiar with too much of the states. I know where some places are. In the Grand Forks. Got the beat going on, guys. T-shirt. That's what I'm saying. It all depends where you are. Sometimes it's uh, 
We'll always get shitty weather out here. No, because this is what Canada is. It's gold. You're just lucky because you're back on that shit end. Canada is usually cold. Most provinces do have a lot of snow. It's cold. Not too many, uh... Well, I know Winnipeg is cold. But you go to Ontario, and you go to, Cal yeah, you go to Calgary, yeah, they got, they got lots of snow too. So, it's just certain parts of us you can almost say, don't get too cold. I think it all depends. <laughs> fat. Fat, fat it. Who goes to Ontario by choice? Nobody. <laughs> That's like going to Saskatchewan. I hope nobody's from Saskatchewan because you know what? We don't like them for our football. They're always against us. Just touching up the white. Seventy five degrees. <laughs> if I could afford to go to BC, I'd be there. It's expensive in BC, it is. It's, you get good jobs, but you get a good job, but it's. You're paying for it. I mean, don't get me wrong, all, all of Canada has beautiful areas. Like, I mean, we got a lot of trees, that's a nice thing. with the, the 
fish. Put the bird. There's, there's the back end, a little bit of a wash on the back. With the feathers. Trying to get the colors in. Uh, final stage is to get, there's sort of like a, there's three colors going in here. Like one on the, one on the top here. And then one sort of half and one in the middle. And then I gotta repaint the fish because I wouldn't touch the fish. Where I wasn't supposed to. And a little bit of black. Oh yeah, the abalone shells, eh? That looks pretty cool. Those things are really cool. Nope, those film. <laughs> you know, a big four liter gallon of milk here? Four liter is about almost five bucks. Thanks, man. That's, that's what I could say here. happy with this. Good. Watch my goodness. You will see. Uh, yeah, I did see that one. I did see that. I like that one. That Avalon is it's pretty cool, that stuff you're using. It's pretty cool. Oh, I thought it was the other one you showed with the. You had that one in in the in one of your. What did you use it in then? I saw. Three hundred rounds. Yeah, because I've seen them in those in other vids. I thought that's what you were talking about. Okay, well, we'll have to check that one out when it's uploaded. It's milk. Yeah, the fan's a little bit, it's not as noisy as I thought it would be. I like that. Um, it's actually doing a pretty good job of sucking all the, the fumes out, which again, we're only using acrylics, so which is good. Uh, though we do use a little bit of England in, Indian ink. This is most of Good stuff, I'm glad it looks better so I've just got a couple more things to do and then it's uh, 
it's going to be off to the uh, the epoxy stage. That's going to be my next my next step. And then I got to work on the stick, which she doesn't want nothing. I'm using like a four inch dowel. Cheeks, yeah, which is going to attach to that or four inch, no, two, it's two and a half inch, I should say. And uh, I just got to shave it down a bit so it's more hand orientated. And the story behind this is it's ought to be higher than Thompson water seal. Mm -hmm. Heard of it. Oh man, yeah. Well, this the story behind it is for the native staff. It has to be higher, taller than. Has to be taller than the than the chief.
Nice. Picked up some rolling pins. They all look good. So I used that little tool today. Where the hell did I put it? Yeah, there it is. That's pretty cool. You gotta push on it in order for it to spin. I like it. I mean, I didn't even know what the hell if I wanted. So it's a Dremel Go. And it's just a little screwdriver. The drill like this? Can you, can you see it? It's, it's more of a, it's just a screwdriver, eh? I mean, it's got a USB in the back with a little setting to go faster. It goes a little, like, to, to run it to speed. Uh, it's um, USB. So it runs it runs off of, uh, like, a charger, like, a, like for your phone. I have no idea why they, you can, yeah, you can get drill bits too, yeah. Yeah, definitely. I had no idea. Um, I won this or when I entered to win it because the last thing I remember was the cart was the pumpkin thing so um, so there are little fumes that come out of this pot and it's getting sucked into here so that's that I'm happy about Nice to win some guys. Yeah, pick. Yeah, I get you. Okay, I gotta just gonna touch up some brown. Yeah, I'm gonna try. It was something about repurposing an old item, I think, eh, Jordy? I think that was the, the next one.
right, right. Yeah. Right now I gotta get this guy done. Oh. You always, he said that last time, you bugger. He told me that last time and you won. I think you got third place and I got like fourth. <laughs> but you always got a chance, buddy. You know what, they, they're looking for people who can inspire and that's what we are. We're, we inspire, we, we help out, we, we give information, we got good, you know, I think if we got good PR with everybody, that's, that's, I like that. That's what I'm thinking. You know, entertaining. You gonna tell them that's okay. Or you know what, you know what, no, win it and then give it away on your channel. You don't, you don't need it. Give it away as a prize for your channel. Why not? I think that'd be a great idea. I think the next thing I win, if I win, I'm not going to say I'm going to win. Next thing, if I win, I'm not even going to open it. I'm just going to unbox it. I'm going to look like, look at it through. And I'm going to put it up as a prize for everybody. I think that would be, that'd be awesome. I think it'd be fair to for everybody else to win. You know, people on your channel my child to get a chance to win. I hope so. I can't wait to see that. I saw that Uncle, Uncle, uh, your uh, Grumpy Jesse shirt. <laughs> did you actually make that one or is, did you just, you're just fooling around? I know, but you always get, nice to give away. Once I start getting in there, I'm gonna start doing that too. I wanna get, I wanna, I wanna share. Oh, he stopped by. Better watch, he's gonna want some uh, licensing fees for using his his character. <laughs> okay, a little bit more brown. Looks like I'm gonna have to go back to the art symposium and get some more paint. Be the next stop. Try to get it, yeah. Come on over, I'll invite you for coffee. You can have it. Oh, my boys are just sick. A welding helmet about 20 years ago from Miller. <laughs>
I'm pretty happy with that. Just the fish face I have to play with, and like I said, that triangle, and that's it. So the rest is just going to be, thanks guys, let's see the fish face, yeah the fish face, it's a little blue, it's a little, little blue, I'm going to get rid of that, I, gotta, I might add some more red in there or maybe even some green, get some more green back in there, I think that's what I wanted to do. I think so. Because I wanted to have a little bit of green. Well, more green, I guess. <laughs> yeah, green. Yeah. That's going to be the end of the painting for the night because now I have to, like when you put too many layers on it, it's following salmon, yet. Yeah. It's a lot blue, red is a good choice. Thanks, man. Um, now when you put enough of this paint on it, I mean, it's, you got to give it some time to dry too. I'm just adding layers and layers and layers. We could, it needs a walking, it needs a walking stick. Always caught. I mean, if you're not going to make one, I can make one. Go with it. If he wants to, to draw, you know, he, he has a chance like everybody else. I like that. the fun part. He can draw my logo. Well I've already I already committed to to doing the contest already so I mean in that sense where if he wants to participate is that what you mean? A bit my turn. <laughs> Might not be too little stick man. <gasps> he can, yeah, yeah, absolutely. I'd love to. But just like I said, uh, you have to be a sub to enter, or else if you're not a sub and you're just throwing pictures at me, I'm not going to accept them because I'll send them back to you. It just kind of. So I know that you're part of the group, kind of thing, I guess. On your draw, I got. I'm going to do a video on the drawing I got for you. Okay. <laughs> That's going to be fun, I'm sure, man. I know what you're going to do. The, Rob, are you at in, in the USA or no? This is for anybody. Um, again, we always—it's harder to ship stuff out of, like out of our two countries. So it's based on. To be again, I got to get better using Instagram. Um, the, well, you know what, Jordy, I'm—I kind of threw out a couple of things. For the drawing, um, you know, like something to do with paths, 
um, you know, something to do with like some sort of nice scenery, like um, um, like trees. You know, maybe somebody standing by a tree, looking down at path. I don't know. I for oh, I know for you forgot. Don't worry. I know. But uh, I, I don't know. It's it could be something totally out there. But I mean, I mean if it if, if if it catches my eye, it's it's what I want, right? So. I'm giving I'm giving people the choice of just draw whatever you want to draw it if it looks good. Yeah, sort of like the crossroads kind of thing, yeah. But it's it's gotta represent what I'm about, right? The choosing your own path, uh, you know, just I guess in the, I sent a video like that to Rich. Is there a Oh come on! There is a guaranteed winner. I will. I will guarantee that out of one of one of the three one of the three sticks, I will send out. I'm. I. You know what? I don't care. If a, if one picture gets sent to me, that person, I'm gonna take their their. Um, I'm gonna take that as a logo because that's what I want. Um, now, if, you know, I got 300 subs and 300 people send me a picture well then I got a lot of I got a lot of look into doing it. Um, I'm definitely I'm definitely going with with what catches my eye right I guess that's as much as I could say um, first prize will be one of my sticks second prizes will be second and third prize will be the uh, one of the carvings you could think you pick one of the carvings Yeah, that, thanks, Joy. I, you know what? Just make sure you, you mention to them that they have to be a subscriber on my channel to enter and to send it to my email, which is like, it's just the richard.vorio at gmail.com. So my name, right? Richard with a dot and then my last name at gmail.com. I want the Grim Reaper. Oh, that guy's gone, man. The Grim Reaper's gone. That's actually sent out to a guy um, in Edmonton, one of the paint uh, air, airbrush artists. He's uh, um, I'm part of his group, and I really like like the guy's really awesome too. So I just wanted no, no, I didn't sell some of his stickers so I could you know I could put it in my shop and that. That's I I like doing that kind of stuff, right? I mean, if I always say if people have stickers of their business. I'll post it in my shop and every time I'm doing vids, whatever. So I just asked him if I could have a couple of his stickers and he said to me, he says, you know what? You send me something, I send you something. And I said, fair, fair enough. So I sent him one of those and he's gonna be doing it. On, he's, he's at the 10,000 mark also. Did you, you think you, you just sent me a sticker or you, you have sent me, you haven't sent me one before. So unless it's with the shirt, I, I don't think so. I haven't got anything, no carbon fusions. I, you know, I really don't have anybody's stickers except for Iwata. <laughs> That's the only one I have. So I don't. Short and sticker, short, shirt and sticker. Oh, I hope so. That, that'd be awesome. So I'll display that. With the rest of my stuff, like I mean, that's what I'm doing. Eh? I'm just uh, promoting other people's sort of business kind of thing. Uh, you know what? You'll send me one. It's awesome. You know what? Hit me up on. I'll put a smoke in there, but it took it away because I had to use. <laughs> that's good. Uh, Rob, if you got a sticker or something, that'd be awesome. I would definitely, definitely put that on my wall. Um, you can uh, you can hit me up on on Facebook or whatever. I can give you my address, um, or you can email me through that Richard and I'll definitely, definitely do that. I want to show you something, guys. 
gonna show you something right away. Just let me give me a second here. This is a piece that I'm working on. I wanna see I wanna I wanna see if what you what you guys think of it. Alright guys. This is a piece I'm working on. It's a tin butterfly, so you can see, and that's on a root ball. All right, so I don't know if you can see that, but this is a piece that I'm working on. I don't know what kind of root root that is. It's just something that I found, and this is this is just an idea of a butterfly that I got and I actually just cut it out all right so I basically I need to shine like you know like you do there George you will spit test you got I gotta shine it up I'm thinking I'm gonna take the I'm gonna take the um, the butterfly off and put them legs I'm not even sh I'm not even sure there's something out here but I want to put I want to put legs on them so that like I, I kind of stuck them in there I've done this project earlier and then we'll see because he is I can take him out right you can see I'm wiggling him around so and then clean up but I'm gonna take him off really clean up the root ball it's a great vine yeah it's it's I don't even it's solid it's kind of I don't know you're right maybe it looks kind of cool. I like that. I mean, I think I, I really like the way it looks. So anyway, that's what I'm working on next sort of thing. And then I'm going to put that up on my, on the website with Charles. And polish. I, I can't see that last comment, so I have to wait. Okay, and polished copper. So wait until you paint it yeah uh, well I'd like to I'd like to paint the butterfly give them like a whole bunch of nice cool colors I'm not sure you know what the ideas will come they'll, they'll come so sorry my daughter is trying to message me and she's just upstairs isn't that great technology allows that eh? So, uh, that, my friends, would be the end of this video because I've been on here for about an hour, oh, two hours, look at that, painting and talking and listening to everything. So, nice, I want to see, I want to see that. So, I'm going to be shutting it down and uh, it'll upload and go on to YouTube, whatever, figure it out. So we'll talk to you guys in the next one. Uh, that guy will be done uh, and start with the epoxy and then work on the sticks. So uh, try to get that done, it has to be done soon enough. So thanks for coming along guys. Right on Mike, thanks for being there. You guys are all awesome. I know I don't have a huge following on this stuff, but uh, really appreciate you guys coming and talking to me and watching and doing stuff like that. So let's uh, let's let's go from there, right? Okay, guys, choose your own path. Thanks. Later, when you get to say, say I will.